the other day I went shopping and I got lots of lovely autumn wintery clothes to keep me nice and warm because it's suddenly got much chillier here in the UK and it's coming up to winter time and Christmas time and I need to be dressing a lot warmer and I didn't have that many good warm things in my wardrobe so I went shopping and I got lots of lovely things I'm going to show them to you. I'm mainly filming this video because I sent a tweet out on Twitter saying I went shopping and so many of you sent tweets saying do a haul, do a haul or maybe I said would you like to see a haul? I can't remember what I said. But anyway, I said something about shopping and all of you said haul. So this is going to be the haul. The first place that I went was Topshop and I love me some Topshop. It's just good and easy to find stuff. It's one of those high street stores that I think is laid out really well and although I don't like shopping in the massive one in London on Oxford Street but I was shopping in Norwich. All of this stuff other than what I got online on ASOS which you'll see in a moment um, I bought in Norwich and I just like shopping here where I live because it's calm and it's peaceful, everyone moves a little bit slower whereas in London it's like rah, fight over the top, really busy Oxford Street. Um, not that I've ever fought over a top by the way, I was just trying to, I was just trying to explain to you guys that London shopping can be stressful sometimes depending on where you choose to shop, um, but I like the Norwich top shop. Now as soon as I walked into the store I saw this gorgeous high-waisted velvet skirt in, it's such a beautiful like wine red colour, it's a little mini skirt, high-waisted, these are just so easy to wear, they suit so many different figures. Um, I just think that it's really, really flattering. This with woody tights and black ankle boots, it would look gorgeous with like a cream chiffon shirt tucked into it to make it a bit smarter. Or I would wear this just with like a black t-shirt tucked in just for daytime. Um, but the material, ooh, this was not too expensive, 28 pounds. And it feels like really nice material, so I thought that was quite good. Oh, also the jumper that I'm wearing, I was wearing in my last video, which was my everyday makeup tutorial. If you want to go and check that out, I'll put the link down below. Um, but I was wearing the grey one of these and I got it in this colour as well because I love it so much. Um, it's not in this haul video, number one because I'm wearing it, and number two because I didn't buy it on the shopping trip. I just went and got these two jumpers at one time. Oh, I've just discovered that this skirt has pockets. That gives it extra points. Look, I absolutely love clothes with pockets because I can just put little things in there. Okay, next. I got this hat. Everyone has to have a woolly hat to keep them warm at winter time and I think that this one is a really beautiful colour. Um, I have brown eyes and purple and brown look really really nice together. It makes your eyes look even more brown and pretty and so I just thought this was a nice colour to go for. Um, last year I wore all the time I was wearing a hat similar colour to this um, to this actually which was nice and I'll probably still wear it this year but I kind of always like to get a new bobble hat I don't know why but I'll put it on and demonstrate for you this one's a bit my last year's one was quite like baggy whereas this one is a lot more fitted I really really like it and the bobble oh the bobble is so so soft and yeah it's it's nice to have like a fitted option and like a baggy bobble hat option I think and the last thing that I picked up from Topshop I only got three things from Topshop um, were these gorgeous little socks of polar bears on I just think they're so cute I'm a massive fan of navy and white I don't know why I just really kind of appreciate those colours together and I've been wanting some Christmassy socks that are comfortable and I find that lots of Christmassy socks have like glitter in and they're like not very good quality socks and I just I like Topshop socks and I think that he is really cute. Oh and if you can hear any funny noises down here guys, have a little someone who would like to meet you. I've got a little Poco that I'm looking after. Look! How cute is he? Poco! <laughs> so Jim and I are babysitting his sister's puppy and he is so cute. Are you gorgeous Poco? Say hi to everyone. Hi YouTube. You are so cute. Anyway. Paco decided he wanted to be up here with me when I was filming, so here he is, and he is just lovely. Next I went to Primark, which is opposite Topshop where I live, and I saw this dress in the um, window of the shop, and I was just like, wow, this is the perfect Christmas party dress. Look, it has a sequined, it's like that beautiful mulberry wine colour kind of thing again, and it has a sequin top that's kind of like nice and fitted then it goes in at the waist and this was £17 and I just think that is amazing value for a beautiful Christmas party dress and it just is just fitted so nicely. 
Then I got even more into the Christmas spirit and I picked up these leggings which feel like the softest, most comfiest things ever and they have the cutest little Santas on and I just can imagine just cozy up on the sofa with a nice hot chocolate and a book or even a Christmas film and yeah, by the Christmas tree, just wearing these. I think these are probably gonna be quite popular filming bottoms for me as well because I always film with comfy bottoms on. I have comfy bottoms on right now. I can show you these ones, which I love from Tesco. These were like three pounds 50 or something and they're super comfy, super duper Christmassy. I'm getting so excited for Christmas by the way. I just tweet about Christmas all the time. I must be driving people mental over on Twitter. I also got this Christmas jumper. It is so cute. Oh my God, can't wait to wear that. I'm going to do some Christmas cooking videos. Would you like that guys? Don't know if you would. Um, I'm thinking about doing some Christmas baking videos and maybe some Christmas little DIYs or something and I obviously want to dress Christmassy for it, so I got a couple of Christmas jumpers. Here's another one that I got. After Primark, I headed to Zara, and I always have faith in Zara that there'll be something in there that I like, but actually, I didn't really like any of the clothes that much in there, so what I got from Zara, was filling up this bag, was just one thing, and it's this scarf. And this scarf is huge, it's pretty much like a blanket. I can't even show you guys how big it is, it's probably like, oh, I just covered up Poco with the blanket, he's so cute. It's basically just a massive scarf and what I really like about this is that it will keep me really warm and I'm often traveling on trains, sometimes even aeroplanes, um, and it can be quite cold. And I think this is just the perfect thing to travel with in the winter time because you can wear it as a scarf, like I'll demonstrate now. I'm probably not gonna demonstrate very well, by the way. Do, do, do. Imagine this with my hat on, like a big, leather jacket or coat or something. I think this would look really, really nice with a leather jacket. Um, I probably didn't um, position that scarf very well then, guys, because I can't really see what I'm doing, so I have a mirror in front of me. I probably could look, make it look a lot better. But then if I got cold and I was on a train, I could literally use this as a blanket. Um, so I'm really excited about that. And that's all that I picked up when I was shopping in Norwich, but I also made an ASOS order online because there was a few things that I felt like I was missing from my winter wardrobe. Oh, that fluffy from the scarf has just got all over me. Um, my favourite thing that I got from ASOS, actually, I really like everything I got, but this is just the first thing I'm going to show you, is this dress. And I wear so many of this kind of thing in wintertime. It's a velvet skater dress with three quarter length sleeves. It's basically one of the most flattering things that you can wear if you have a figure similar to me. So, not that tall and kind of curvy. Um, it's just really flattering. It's probably flattering on lots of people. Um, but yeah, three quarter length sleeves and then in at the waist and then a gorgeous like flippy skirt comes out of that. Really cute print. It's kind of similar to the scarf actually. Probably wouldn't wear those together. The next thing I've got from ASOS is really boring but it's just such a staple and this is ASOS's own brand. I don't know how much this was. ASOS never have the prices on the tags which is kind of annoying. Um, but it's just a plain navy um, round necked jumper that's quite fitted and not too thick. Um, this basically I will use to tuck into high-waisted skirts like my um, high-waisted leather skirt. I could even tuck this into the skirt that I bought from Topshop, the velvet kind of wine coloured one. Just keeps you a bit warmer than just tucking a top in sometimes. I couldn't not get this when I saw this on ASOS and it's this Christmas jumper. I just think this is so, so cool. It feels really lovely quality and it's not so thick. So this would be a good kind of Christmas dinner jumper because I feel like I might get a bit hot because uh, I know that in my parents' house they'll have the fire on and Christmas dinner and it all gets a bit too hot so you often want something not like a massively thick jumper. So maybe this will be my Christmas dinner jumper. Love it. And the last thing that I picked up was from ASOS as well and it's this coat. Um, I just was watching Love Actually the other day and I saw Martine McClutchen's character wearing a red coat and it just looked so Christmassy and gorgeous and really kind of classy and chic so I decided I needed a bright red coat and the only place I could find like a seriously bright red one was on ASOS. This is just super flattering um, shape, has a lovely collar, it's like fitted on top and then just goes um, out from the waist, just kind of like flips out. I'll just hold it back here so that you can see. You can't see that very well on camera, but maybe I'll do like some wintry outfit of the days or something like that for you guys, if you'd like that. I'm definitely going to be doing a Christmas party get ready with me. Um, and maybe this will be the finishing touch of putting on the coat before I walk out the door so that you'll be able to see it on. 
or I'll Instagram it or something like that. So that is everything that I got. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you click the like button. Maybe it gave you some inspiration for your winter wardrobe. Oh, exciting news. I think I'm going to do Vlogmas, which is where you vlog, like daily vlog. I'll take you around with me every single day leading up to Christmas throughout December. Um, I'm a bit nervous about it because it's a massive commitment. I did it last year and the year before and that will be over on my vlog channel. So if you'd like me to do Vlogmas, go and subscribe to my vlog channel and leave me a comment on this video telling me that you'd like me to do it. I will put a link for my vlog channel and my blog and everything else that I've talked about in this video, I'll put a link for down below in the description box. Here. Oh, other news is that my blog is about to hit 50,000 followers over on Blog Loving, which is so, so exciting. I've been putting a lot of effort into my blog recently, doing kind of like recipe posts over there, fashion posts, beauty posts, and just like photos of what I've been up to. So if you'd like to go and check that out, then I'll put the link to my blog down below and it would make my day if you followed it on Blog Loving. And that's going to be it for this video. Thank you for sticking with me throughout that long ramble. Um, but I just like chatting, sorry. And I will see you next time. Bye. And goodbye from my little sleeping poco. Hey everyone, so I went shopping out of your bed. Yuck. Jim, can you shut your door so that you're not listening? Have you started your game? Okay, good. No, not at all. Are you playing Batman? A colder time of year and I feel like I haven't got enough cotton there. Today I went shopping and I got lots of lovely wintry... Why is it taking so long to do an intro? Hey guys. I'm out of breath all of a sudden. Look, fluff. Just licking my finger, so cute. Look how cute. Poco. I made an ASOS order for a few there. I'll have all that fluff now.